Okay, we're gonna go over a quick review of the setup and takedown of the 2016 Jayco J Flight 19 RD. All right, once you get back then, you're gonna back this up into your campsite. Once you get back then, got a couple different ways of leveling it. You can, uh, I like to use the wood. If, if one side's lower than the other to bring the one side up, that's one piece and then there's two pieces screwed together. Or the other option is to use the ramps to level it up each tire and then put a uh, chalk once you get level before you disconnect it from the trailer put a chalk in the, in the front of the ramps that way uh, it doesn't slide this will be your electric jack to raise it uh, up raise the camper up or down you got a light here if it's dark this is your gas i'm gonna turn this on when you get to the site turn bottles on if one bottle goes out it should automatically swap over to the other one. And you're only going to use gas for uh, your stove and your refrigerator. If you're, if you're running off a generator, use gas. And your uh, water heater, you can use gas if you're running off a generator. If you're hooked up to shore power, you want to put all that stuff on power. All right. So we got set up. Next thing we're going to do is uh, lower our jacks down. Once you got the camper set up and level, and I got an impact for that in this container here. And all you gotta do is hook up to the jack and turn the impact and I'll lower the jack all the way down. Same thing with coming back up. You'll do that to all four jacks on all four corners. And that this container stays under this cabin. So that container will be under that cabinet along with your water hose and some sewer and a container with some sewer fittings in it. That container with some sewer fits. All right, this is your exhaust for your water heater. This is where you can hook up your water from the city water connection or from the main connection. Here's an outdoor shower. There's keys inside the camper. You can unlock that and open it up if you wanted to use the outdoor shower. There's your exhaust for your refrigerator. There's your fresh water fill up. You only need that if you don't have a city water that's the heater exhaust the heater in this camper we actually just use two electric heaters we don't use the the main heater cable you got it at the site and the power you pull it right out of here and plug it into your uh, 30 amp hookup all right got the sewer hoses at the end of the bumper on both sides Here's your low point drain for your fresh water. I'm gonna valve it out. This is closed. This is your sewer hookup. Left side's gray water, right side is black water. You would hook up your sewer hose here. And then run that to your uh, sewer outlet. Clean out. That's if you need to do that on your own. If not, I would take care of it. Rear of the camper, spare tire. Let's walk around to the front of the camper. Front of the camper, you just let your stairs out. This is what they're gonna look like when you travel. You just grab this bottom, pull them out. I do the top. And you're out outdoor electric if you need it another door got the camper rug right there with the stakes you can lay that out in front of the door put your stakes out and there's your exhaust for your stove on the inside outdoor speakers and that's it that's all you need to know to set up the camper on the outside I'll do another video about the inside of the camper